Good morning, fam. Are we on the air? Yes, we is. <laughs> man, I'm out here, man. Good morning, fam. Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy, TYT, and you on TYTV, TYT Vlogs, y'all. So, man, I'm out here this morning uh, getting ready to start my week. <laughs> it's Tuesday, y'all. It's back to work. I was off all day yesterday. Y'all saw the vlog, you know. Uh, I got up and tried to pick some more weeds, but you know, I'm over that, man. So I'm at Dunkin', of course. So I'm gonna come in here and get me a coffee, and I'm gonna holler at y'all a little bit, man. Sit back, relax, and step it down. I'll come along as I go throughout my day. Being TYT, y'all. Yo, I did a whole clip, man, and my mic was connected to my other uh, camera. <sighs> Anyways, I'm out here, man. I'm at Harold's, y'all. Man, I had to come get me some fries, man. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know, I'll be doing the chicken like that, y'all. I really don't. But, you know, um, I'm just straight getting it, man. <laughs> man, my lens looking clean. You know, it's because you know, I, I just started using this camera again. And it's not because, you know, of nothing with the camera. My car was just full. <laughs> and then I was getting happy with my little smaller camera, the, my first camera that I bought. So um, I'm just going up here and grab me something to eat real quick, y'all. And then it's back out here. You know, I'm just straight working, man. But, you know, I haven't ate nothing today, man. It's like, like almost 2 o'clock. <laughs> so I'm going to go over here wait for my order to be done. And I'm going to holler at y'all a little bit. Yo, so I got my fries, y'all. I got my fries. So, uh, it's back to the car. Get off to the rest of this day. You know, it's crazy. DoorDash send you all the way out here <laughs> and then don't give you nothing else, even though you're outside the zone. <laughs> and like, good luck. Thank you. No, thank you. At least that's how I'll be feeling. You know what I mean? But, uh, I'm gonna sit y'all right here. Come on. There y'all go. So I'm gonna sit y'all right there. And we gonna um, check out these uh, fries. I mean, <laughs> I was about to, I'm about to sound real, uh, real old school. I was about to say, I'm about to learn y'all about some fries and that mild sauce. Ooh. Let me turn this on because it feels like I'm in the uh, a sauna, but well, I guess I could have got extra mouth sauce, y'all, because <laughs> they stingy as hell. They stingy as hell, man. Look at this. They put some mouth sauce on there, but you ain't going to be able to dunk it unless it's all over in a corner or something. You know what I mean? But, oh, my gosh. They stingy as hell with the mouth sauce, y'all. That's the fries with the mouth sauce. So, you know, I'm going to go ahead and eat these, get back to the zone so I can keep delivering. I'll let y'all a little bit, man. <laughs> <laughs> what's well, good fam so it's the next day um but you know i just i just got you know the urge to want to vlog on this channel so what's up <laughs> i showed and wrapped the video up from yesterday so we just gonna keep it going man uh it's like almost one o'clock out here y'all and i'm in tempe y'all and i'm at this uh one duncan that i like you know, I don't want to jinx myself and then they mess up my coffee because then I'm going to be upset. But I'm out here nonetheless, y'all. So I'm going to go ahead and grab a coffee and then I'm going to holler at y'all in a lit bit. Yeah, man. coffee status, man. <laughs> Gotta get it. Gotta get it. <sighs> I'm drained, y'all. I got my door that, I mean, my grub up on. But I'm not getting nothing from them right now, so. It is what it show sure enough is. I'm the cleanest lens too, so. Um, it was good, fam. So yesterday, when I got home from work, I, um, 
Oh, was that after I got home from work? Yeah, I moved my car. I moved my truck into the driveway. But it's in the middle of the driveway. But it's in a perfect spot, kind of. Because if my car wasn't in the garage, <laughs> I could move the truck in the garage. You know what I mean? Because it'll fit right in the garage. And that's kind of what I want to do. Just put the truck in the garage, clean my garage out. So then um, I could fit my car in there eventually. You know, I'm going to end up getting these uh, dollies. So that I can sit my... Um, you know, that I can put under the wheels of my cars and I can just move the cars over. So, yeah, I'm probably just going to uh, have the car <laughs> and the truck kind of just moved over to the sides or pushed together. I don't know. Whichever gives me more room in the garage. But <clears throat> um, So I'm going to get a, another battery so I can start the Dodge up and move it out of the garage. So then I can... Um, <laughs> move the car out so then I can move the truck in the garage so that's the game plan Stan so um, let me go in this uh, store and get some money and I'll be back with y'all man so now I'm at the battery place man I end up getting my cash you know they only do cash only you know <laughs> they got it right over the dough just so you know so ain't gonna be no problems you know what I mean uh, so I'm gonna come up in here. See what I can do so I can get these cars moved. <laughs> anyway, man. Um, uh, I'm looking for this battery, the the 2014 Dodge Avenger. Yeah, but it's... it's uh, uh, group 86. Yeah, we have a brand new for 80 with exchange. Or uh, no, burgers for 40 with exchange. Okay. And then if you don't have the exchange, it's $15 more. Oh, it's 15 more without the exchange. Okay. Um... trying to think okay um how long is the uh, warranty on on the, the uh refurbished is 60 days and the brand new is one year okay all right all right all right all right, all right, all right. <sighs> uh, something told me it was gonna be more than that for because I just went and got cash but to get from over there to back over here is like crazy <laughs> Because uh, I just bought a battery from here like a few months ago and it's uh, dead on the car already and I need to move it. So I'm just coming to buy another battery just so I can move the car. But yeah, I have to, I have to go get uh, more money. I'll be right back. Okay. All right. <sighs> Guys. $15 for the exchange. I mean, so the uh, $15 is non refundable. So if I bring back the other battery, okay, cool, cool, cool. cool. That's all. That, that, all right, thank you. So that's cool. The battery that's in the Dodge, I can bring it back. That get my fifteen dollars back. So I'll definitely do that because for a brand new one, it's eighty dollars. Uh, eighty dollars with a one-year warranty. Um, but that's with the uh, exchange too. So to still be 80, I mean, $95. So, um, I'm gonna just run across the street right here real quick again. Yeah, me crazy out here, man. Whew. 
They don't care about people walking across the street. Mesa in all of its glory, guys. Dude, Mesa in a nutshell. I wish I could zoom with this camera, with this lens. I'm gonna be getting another lens for this camera soon, so. It's tight up in there. It's tight. <laughs> the dude in the store, I was like, I was like, yeah, uh. Gotta get more money. They copyright me, man, anyway, so I'll let y'all a little bit. So each one of those withdrawals cost me uh, three dollars. So that's six dollars for nothing for <laughs> fees. <sighs> Man, I'm really trying to get back to work though, y'all, to be real with you. Like I just was trying to come and get a battery real quick so then I can get back to delivering and think that, you know, it'll be in between deliveries like 30, 40 minutes. And that's not gonna happen now. It's gonna be like an hour, an hour just like that between deliveries, so. It's bad out here, y'all. But yeah, I was telling the guy, I was like, man, I thought it was just 40, man, because I had to, he was like, yeah, go on, come on with that $15. <laughs> Ugh. He got that boy Cam, but then like, um, I don't like how they had a, the back squatting down like that. I don't like that look, but come on up in here and grab this battery, man. So I can, um, cause I'm gonna eventually use a Dodge. So that's why I'm buying the battery for it. My dumb ass left the battery hooked up on the car. So I'm just end up taking it out completely now. So but anyway, I'm out, yeah. Just like that, man. I'm gonna holler at y'all a little bit. I got the battery, y'all. I ain't gonna do what I did one time in the Dodge. I sat it on the back seat, then it failed, and all this stuff leaked out in the car. Horrible. But uh, I'm gonna holler at y'all a little bit, man. I gotta get the battery in the car. I only got two hands. So I already got my, how I'm gonna put it. That's funny, they wanna charge you $15 for a core, but then you bring in an old battery to sell them, and then they only give you $3 for it. It's the next morning, y'all, like, <laughs> <laughs> uh man i'm not gonna start another video for the simple fact that i'm not happy with the last two two days of footage that i have i have i haven't watched it back but just from what i've been recording i know i'm not happy with that man but 
As y'all can see, my window is down. Because the window regulator broke on my car. <laughs> the first thing to go bad on the car, y'all, was the window regulator. So, you know, let's just keep our fingers crossed and hope, you know, nothing else. You know, okay. <laughs> so I'm headed to AutoZone right now, to man, to go get, to go get a window regulator so I can fix this boy. So I'm going to holler at y'all in a little while, man. Man, I didn't like that last clip, but it's the next day, y'all. Um, so I'm at AutoZone. <laughs> I'm out here, man. So my window regulator went out on my car yesterday, y'all. I'm on my way home or on my last delivery or whatever. And then the window just, every time you hit a bump, it just goes down more and more and more and more and more. So yesterday, um, in the early evening, I think it was or whatever, but you know, I'm pulling out of a, a, a driveway and then I hear a loud boom. So I'm thinking I left something on top of the car, like, you know, so I get out and look. But in hindsight, I realized that the uh, regulator fell off. So I don't know if, if it's broken it needs to be repaired. I mean, put back on or if it just needs a new one. So I just ordered a new one at this auto zone. So um, I'm just realizing I don't have my tools for my um, to remove the paneling, but it's okay. You know, shouldn't be too bad. You shouldn't need no tools to get this, to pop these off, you know. I should be able to get that off pretty easy. Um, but I'm thinking that this happened before because <laughs> either it wasn't put on well because i've never had a regulator fall off like that before but or never even seen it but i'm gonna go ahead and do this y'all i'm gonna let y'all a little bit <laughs> so now i got the uh the door panel off so uh now it's just uh basically taking this uh film off I don't think you have to take this off. I didn't see him say, or the guy, the one that YouTube video I watched. I didn't see him say that you had to take that off. But, here's where we're at. I can see the carnage now. Okay, so I'm gonna have to take this off. Whew. All this is hand tightened. I'm just using this uh, wrench or uh, socket and extension, just like a screwdriver, basically. Man, but I was I was over there at first, guys. <laughs> then I was like, man, look at all the shade over here. I come over here and get shady. You know, it was kind of cool driving over here though, cause it was kind of cold driving over here. Sorry, y'all. Ah, there we go. <laughs> so it was kind of cold driving over here. Ah, I don't know where I want to put the camera. You know, I was about to say if I had my tripod, but this camera's too heavy for my tripod. Uh, I'm taking, I'm taking this off. Uh, Try not to lose stuff. You know, I do a real vlog today. You know, not so much of the mumbo jumbo that I normally do with talking. So, so it should be able to come off. It's windy out here, so I should. Ugh. It stuck straight to my coffee thing, the top came off. Good time for a cook of coffee. Hey, Mia, what is your, what is your mom, what does your mom do? What's her job? She's a 
I'm listening to Sway, by the way, guys. Okay, here's the window. I'm going to do some investigation real quick. Come back to y'all in a minute, man, because I only got one hand. <laughs> okay, uh, hopefully. <laughs> it comes with a whole nother part, y'all. But I'm not good with my cameras lately, man. Like, I don't know if this card is full or what. But it sucks. That's why I haven't been using this camera because the car that was in here was full. But I'm going to get my life together one day, y'all. Let's get it. Let's go. I'm going to holler at y'all a little bit. Let me go up in here and get this uh, regulator. Wow. I have 2 minutes and 17 seconds left on this car. Like, I don't know. I don't know what's going on with me in these cars. But anyway, y'all. Um, all I got to do is uh, take the regulator out. It should have the motor and everything on it too. And the part that broke that I was showing y'all, the little plastic white part, is already on here. So all I got to do is take this one out and put the new one in and I'll be all good. So I'm going to do that right now, y'all. All right, guys. So I got the new reg window regulator on there. I just got to tighten up the uh, two bolts uh, hooking up the window. And I'm all good, y'all. So, man, <laughs> time to get off to work now, y'all. Uh, I got like a minute left on this card, so I don't know what the hell. But uh, thanks for checking out this video, y'all. Um, back in the game. So let's get it. Let's go.